I wake up in the morning to the moment I fall asleep at night. I was born to play. It's my reason for living. Hello? What the... This weed, it counts off. There's a soul missing. Is this heaven? No. Is it H-E double hockey sticks? Hell, hell, hell. Quiet coyotes. <laughs> no, it's the great before. This is where new souls get their personalities, <laughs> quirks, and interest before they go to Earth. Here we are. Don't worry, you can't crush a soul here. That's what life on Earth is for. Whoa. It's my life. Can you help me get back? Come on. This won't be a disaster, that's for sure. You're out there somewhere, little soul. Life is full of possibilities. You just need to know where to look. Don't miss out on the joys of life. <laughs> like uh, pizza. I can't smell. We can't, we can't taste either? All that stuff is in your body. No smell, no taste. Or touch. See? Okay, I get it. Disney and Pixar Soul. Get ready. Your life is about to start. Start streaming December 25th. Hello, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages. Do one and only Charlie Brown. And I can do this right now. Uh, I, did a, I did a review on Wonder Woman. Go check that out if you get a chance to. But today, I'm about to talk to you. Well, not today, but right now. I'm about to talk to you guys about another movie that came out on Christmas Day itself. Uh, the, pic the Disney Pixar movie called Soul, um, starring these actors. And directed by this. And it came on here. With music by them. On this day. Yeah, so quick review, pass. There you go, that's pretty much it. Uh, well, I don't know if you guys know this, but I'm black. Yeah. Uh, the, <laughs> the, and in the movie, the main character in this movie so happened to be black. Um, they've done so much Pixar. Uh, they've done so much and given us so many great, so many great compelling stories so this like from toy stories um to stories about our feelings to stories about loss to stories about family stories about dinosaurs stories about oh what did i miss you know almost everything in between stories about about animals and 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 ants and insects and bugs and 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 and, and, elm, and objects and if you guys get a chance to go check out some of the Pixar shorts because I'm pretty sure you guys will find some shorts that will bring a tear to your eye. Pixar has a way of getting into your soul and saying, "Listen, I know I'm not supposed to be here." And then your soul goes, "Hold on, have a seat. You can stay." That's pretty much how I feel. And with the movie Soul, that's how I feel. Um. 
uh, at first, I thought they were going to do something that's going to be kind of controversial. Because when it comes to, like, talking about religion or, like, death or, like, the, the afterlife and stuff like that, there's a lot of, there's a lot of like, people questioning it and stuff. And, but I think they did a really good job with how they explained it. Um, uh, I think they did a really good job with, with the whole concept that they had in the movie and the messages they were trying to convey. I understood it. It was easy. Uh, my son got it. At first, my son was like, oh, it was kind of boring. But then he started getting to it later on, especially when they started getting, you know, getting more and more into the music the jazz music and stuff. Uh, the relationship with the characters. Um, every, every voice actor in the movie did a great job. Um, I don't, I'm trying my best not to spoil anything. And I'm because I want you guys to see it. And if you got Disney Plus, go check it out as, as fast as you can. Uh, you know, sit down with your family and watch the movie. But then again, it's a Pixar movie. It, it's not... I, do I know of any bad Pixar movies? I don't think... I don't think at all. I don't think there's ever been a bad Pixar movie. I don't think I've ever seen a Pixar movie where I didn't enjoy it at all. I don't think so. Nope. Nothing comes to mind. Nothing at all. I can't can't even picture it. Not a, not a one. I think I love every single tiny Pixar movie that he ever made. And there's no way. No, no I'm almost sure. I haven't seen any bad Pixar movies at all. None at all. So, all in all, I'm giving it a pass, a high pass. I think you, you go and check it out. Uh, there's a lot of people that don't like jazz music, but it's really good. I'm, uh, I'm telling you, like, Man, listening to jazz music takes me back to the times when I was younger and my, my parents, we had like a bar in the basement and my mom and dad would like play jazz music in the basement, like Kurt Whalen and stuff like that. And, you know, like Boney James and they would just play that type of music. And, you know, it's that music that like stays with you. It's like it's music that just relaxes you and just, you know, just lets you move. Like, the, you know, this... It's like like a lot of hip hop music got you know gets their roots from a lot of stuff in jazz, but jazz music, man, this is something about it. And even having Jamie Foxx voice the character it was a great pick, because when it comes to music and even his voice alone, it's 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 a musical, it's a musical instrument. Just hearing Jamie Foxx speak, um, all in all, all in all, let me slow this down because I told you it was, I was going to do it quick. A quick review. I think I'm already passing the six minute mark. Anywho, I'm just gonna jump it out and throw it out for you guys. It is a pass, a high pass. Hello, how you doing? Gotta get you. And that's a quick. It was a great Christmas gift, especially with everything going on in the world and and closing out 2020 with that. Uh, not only that. Disney actually gave us The Mandalorian, too. So, Disney, they're giving us stuff to close out the year. So, thank you, Disney. Thank you. And more importantly, thank you, Pixar. And thank you, everyone that put this movie together. It was, oh, it was so good. It was so good. You know, again, sit down with your family. Check the movie out. And let me know down below in the comment section or anywhere you see the name Charlie Brown or Around the Town. Or anywhere you if, if you see me walking down the street. Stop me and go, hey. Well, of course, social distance like that. Social distance. Then be like, hey, bro, yes. Did you see so? Yes. Did you like so? Yes. What'd you give so? I gave it a pass. Hello. How you doing? I know you did because I saw your review. If you can pick up what I'm putting down around the town, Charlie Brown. Ta-ta.